prefers eating your boring vanilla cookie to my sweet ginger snap? <laughs> Why don't you go take your resting stank face and work another corner? Just ignore her, Coop. She's such a biatch. You and Luke are totally perfect together. Yeah, sure. Are you okay? You're acting kind of weird. It's just, I don't know. Have you ever wondered what our lives would look, would look like from someone else's eyes? Like whose eyes? <laughs> Never mind. Ew, who invited those two? Be nice. Hey, I didn't know you guys would be here. Of course we'd be here. My mom's company is sponsoring Cotillion, biggest event of the season, where the beautiful and radiant girls of Orange County make their debut in Newport society as beautiful and radiant women. Ew. You look really pretty. Thanks. You clean up pretty nice. So, Summer, do you need an escort for tonight? I happen to know a handsome young man of the finest Jewish Protestant pedigree who's available for all of your waltzing, escorting, and purse-holding needs. No thanks, but where is Zach? Oh. Hey, Hottie, are you here yet? What do you mean you're not coming? What do you mean you have to go to L.A. to talk with a famous director about developing your new comic book series? I don't care if it is George fucking Lucas. Your story arc doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> oh, the next time I see your face, I'm gonna punch you so hard that, that you'll be permanently cross-eyed douche! Whoa, that was... What? <laughs> Ragey hot. So you're into comic book guys, huh? Well, you're in luck. Happen to know a young man who's an expert in graphic novels. He practically has a PhD on the subject. You really don't have a choice. I guess I could do worse. Fine, you can be my escort. Just keep your hands above my waist and at least a foot in between us. Hey, Mrs. Cooper. You, uh, keeping it wet? Oh, I am. It's like a swamp down there just waiting for someone to dive in. Oh, my God. <laughs> Kirsten. May I have a word with you? <laughs> well, hello to you too, Julie. Kirsten. What is it, Julie? Do you realize you're sheltering a convict from Chino? Ryan's just a kid. Well, he certainly doesn't look like one. He's only 16. <laughs> well, as you know, we Noopsies pride ourselves on maintaining a safe community for our families. And so you can understand how we simply can't allow our neighbors to start taking in felons, especially white hood rat trash, for that matter. Well, that's not exactly true. We did take you in, after all. Now, if you excuse me. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the 47th annual Newport Beach Debutante Cotillion. As president of the Newport Group, we are delighted to sponsor the event this year. So, without much further ado, please welcome the lovely and talented young ladies of Newport. Naomi Hollingsworth, daughter of Arthur and Brandy Hollingsworth. Crystal DuPont, daughter of Bartholomew and Sapphire DuPont. Tatiana Sheffield, daughter of Maxwell and Francine Sheffield. Holly Fisher, daughter of Gregory and Marianne Fisher. <laughs> Summer Roberts, daughter of Neil and Jim Roberts. Yes, sir. 
our first dance. Just keep your hands above my waist, Sid. As much as I love the sound of your voice when you call me Sid, it's actually Seth. Seth Cohen. Whatever, Cohen, just keep your hands above my waist. Can't believe I got stuck with you as my escort. Ew. Okay, I know I'm not yours or anyone's first choice, but I do have a bit of self-respect. At least an ounce of it, anyway. Can you at least try to be nice for the next minute? The dance is almost over, and let's not forget who's doing you a favor here. Oh, get this straight. I'm doing you a favor by letting you be seen with me. Wow. You're so not who I thought you were. Can't believe you're my dream girl. What? I'm your dream girl. Since when? Ever since kindergarten on the first day of school when you were holding Marissa's hand because she was crying and she was scared. Or then there was the day when you had to read your poem aloud in front of the class and you were so nervous that your hands were shaking. Poem? What poem? I wish I was a mermaid. Do you remember that? I wish I was a mermaid and was friends with all the fish. A shiny tail and seashells. That's what I would wish. I wish I was a mermaid and was friends with all the fish. Shiny tail and seashells. That's what. Trust me, you won't regret this. Although I might. Just just come with me before I change my mind. <laughs> Thank you. 